My question about this machine is, is this a tool to produce art or is it a machine that produces art? You could ask that for anything at the festival. I mean, it's, it's hard to, uh, to really define that, right? For any, any kind of a facility, a computer, you can ask the same thing. So how exactly do you know which kind of sound uh, you will produce in the next minute? Oh, now? I, I, it works in probabilities, because I, I basically have rates that I set with clocks and timers and coincidences that dictate how often some events will happen. I mean, the, uh, the, those chaotic sounds will come and go a little bit random, but on average, every, uh, yeah, I slow the clocks down, so it's like every five seconds. And you know what it's going to play? Nah, well, not exactly, but I know, I know pretty much what it's going to do. studying interactions with computers that were kind of one-on-one, -on -one, person with machine. And then I moved, that is people alone with their computers, then I moved to studying people with people using the computer as a medium for communication, that is the internet. And now I'm studying once again people alone with computers, but computers of a very different nature. This is what that man says. He says, I become my computer. It's not just that I remember people or know more, he feels invincible, sociable, better prepared, naked without it. With it, I'm a better person.
reactions of people who are trying this stuff? How do they react <coughs> mostly? Um, they're actually quite surprised. It's slightly problematic here because it's obviously an exhibition. Precisely located in space and 